Hi everyone, it's me, Sarah B, and I am back to open up a box from Dia and & Company. And I'm pretty stoked. It's freaking huge. <laughs> um, I'm really curious to see what's inside. All my other boxes from Dia have been like little boxes. So, but this is really big. It makes me very curious as to what could be inside. Dia & Company is a store, as well as being a subscription company. Um, they cater in plus sizes, and they've been really, really great. It's $20 to get a box styled. Ugh. Ugh. I got my big scissors. I feel like this is all brute force. Um, $20 to get a box styled. $20 gets credited towards whatever you keep. I'm pretty sure there's a keep all discount. I'm just so excited about opening this box that I haven't paid attention. Oh my gosh! Okay. Um, here's my bag to return anything. I don't want you have five days to try things on and return them. Here is my, uh, my note for my stylist and the invoice. So we'll peek at that later. And there are two separate bundles. And this is why the box is so big. Look at this fluffy coat! Oh my gosh, it's super floofy. It is from MNY Mark New York. It's like a super floofy hoodie. Mm. Kind of, it's like exactly the fabric you want to like wrap up wrap yourself up in and like go to sleep. It's gotta be all acrylic. Oh, but it's beautifully lined too. All right, that is very exciting. Not something I necessarily need, but we're headed into spring. Not that we here in Pennsylvania have really got winter, but that's beside the point. Um, I'm excited to see the patterns in this other bundle. So, for camera. Um, I'm, I want to really get into this. Oh my gosh. This is from Leota. Exclusively for Dia and Company. Look at this dress! It has tulips on it. I love tulips. I don't know if I love the sleeves, but I love tulips. <laughs> Um, and it's spring, and spring means, like, time for, like, skirts and dresses and stuff again. I'm very excited to try this on. The next piece is from Ryan Wythe. I've gotten a bunch of, not a bunch, but some other stuff from him before. That's pretty great. I love the keyhole in the front, and the sleeves have, like, a little gather which gives it a poofy effect. And the next piece is a skirt. It's a skirt from Leota, exclusively for Dia and Company. It's kind of like, it's pretty straight. Um, maxi skirt. I typically like circle skirts. Like I like to have I like extra fabric, I guess, is what I'm saying. <laughs> um, I like to make dramatic twirls. Um, and it's also fabric for my daughter to hide under. And then the last piece is, oh, it's a turtleneck. From Molly and Isadora. The shirt I'm wearing, also from Molly and Isadora. Also received from his Dia and Company box, I'm pretty sure. Um, I think it's the only place I see her stuff, their stuff. Um, I don't typically love turtlenecks, but I've got that Kalanak sweater that I got from a different box. Um, so I'm really curious to try it on and see. I love the color, and I'm really into stripes right now, so, so that's exciting. All right, let me try stuff on and see what it turns out. I, I wouldn't typically wear these together, but for the sake of trying things on in the least amount of costume changes. Um, here is the top by Ryan Wythe, um, which is actually really nice. It's very poofy and um, 
professional and exactly the type of thing I would wear to conferences and to teach. Um, so it's really nice. It fits me right at the hips, like exactly where I wanted to. The keyhole is a nice touch, and then it has this like really nice texture to it, which I'm totally digging. I don't love the skirt as much. Like I said, I like A-line poofy skirts. Not necessarily poofy, but circle skirts more than straight skirts. Um, but it's fine. It's comfortable. It's nice and long. Um, it does have slits on the side, so I won't get like completely tripped up on myself as I'm chasing after my children, but I don't think it's going to be something I'm feeling compelled to keep necessarily. All right, let's keep going. Here's the tulip print dress. It's print and color, and it's what I've been um, lacking desperately in my wardrobe. It fits so perfectly. Like, I couldn't... I couldn't ask for it to fit more perfectly. It has a bit of a floofy skirt. Um, it hits like right at my knees, you can kind of see. Um, and the sleeves are um, non-constricting and kind of loose and lovely. Easter is actually right around the corner. It's I'm filming this on Ash Wednesday. So um, this would be like a lovely spring Easter dress, you know? I'm really excited about it. I'll be more excited when I see how much it costs. <laughs> Make sure it fits into my budget. But for the moment, I am totally in love. So yay! So something I didn't appreciate when I first looked at this is that the, the lining of the top is actually sweatshirt material. It's it's not just like a t-shirt. It's, it's definitely a sweatshirt. And as you can kind of see, um, it's definitely more of a cow neck than a turtleneck, which I totally dig. Um, I am toasty warm. This is lovely color and pattern. Well, stripes or patterns? I don't know. But um, actually, like, really, really much better than I thought it was going to be when I first saw it. Um, I'm really excited, actually. And, like, the striping is different in the bottom. I don't know. I'm, like, now I am... I am conflicted that there are multiple pieces I love. While I've got you here, I'm going to try on this hooded jacket. It feels, um, I don't know, like I'm putting on a, a bear skin or something. It's very floofy. It's very kind of over the top for me. Um, that said, it fits nicely. It's got like lots of elastic in the hem, which coats don't always have for people of my size. Um, yeah, I could snuggle up in this and fall asleep really quickly. <laughs> um, that said, it's not something I need in my wardrobe right now, so I don't think it can stay. But it's really soft and cozy. All right, now let me get back into my clothes and see how much all this is going to cost. All right, now let's see how much it all costs. First... Um, my note from my stylist and I almost said Sabrina because that is my stylist right now my stylist changes quite a lot for DM company which is fine um, I do like how some other subscription boxes have like give you an option which you don't always get anyway but there's an option to keep your stylist so you can like build a relationship but things are like really good anyway um, hi Sarah, hope this box signs you well. I'm pleased you love the jeans in the last box. Totally did. I'm wearing them now. I've included a soft turquoise top to pair with them in this box. Love it. Monday morning, show up for work refreshed and ready to mold minds in the maxi skirt and the white blouse and tights. Add tall boots and the black coat from Mark New York to complete this look and stay cozy indoors. Style the turquoise tee with the jeans in your last box and wedges for a family movie night. On day night, you'll really shine in this rich blue dress by Leota and tights and boots and a short pendant necklace to complete the ensemble. Don't forget your coat on the way out. Aww. I really appreciate good writing. This is lovely writing. Let me know what you think in your feedback and what you'd like to see in the next box. Have fun. Sabrina. Thanks, Sabrina. Um, I have to say, they did, like, a beautiful job putting this box together, and that, like, they clearly know me, and they clearly know, um, what I'm looking for, and, like, what would work. So, anyway, the jacket by Mark New York 
$79 for a jacket. That's a good price. Um, that said, I don't need it. And it's like a little extra for me. <laughs> the fluffiness is a little bit extra. So um, thank you, Sabrina, for thinking of the complete ensemble. Um, but not something I need at the moment. I'm just zipping it up so that when I return it, it will be um, in peak condition. Fun, fun. Um, the Lowell Knot Detail Knit Dress, $65. Which if you think about it, it's only $45 because you've already spent $20 for the box. I really love it. It's beautiful. It's like the pattern that I've been looking for for a while. Um, so that's great. Um, the Ryan White Sammy Textured Blouse, also $65. So that you would kind of like, that's pretty right for the brand, but also for workwear, unfortunately. Workwear is like expensive, man. Everything's expensive these days. Um, the Leota Jasmine Slit Maxi Skirt is $55. Um, that's a little bit much for a maxi skirt. Unfortunately, it's not something I would go to. Um, like, be excited to grab out of my closet. So I think that's going to have to go back as well. And the Molly and Isadora April Long Sleeve Cow Neck Tee is $55. Oh my gosh, yeah. So the merchandise total, oh, so $55 for Molly and Isadora and for like a sweatshirt tee, it's not even like just a regular tee. I think that's a good price as well. Um, I love this brand. I got my first piece of Molly and Isadora anything out of the thread up box. It came new with tags um, out of one of my goodie boxes and fit perfectly. And everything I've ever tried on from them since then has to fit perfectly. Sometimes you just find a brand that works really well for your shape and Molly and Isadore is definitely that for me. So super exciting. Uh, $55. And I really love it. So I'm going to make this work. The merchandise total is $319. The styling fee is $20. That gets credited towards whatever you keep. 25% off when you buy everything saves another $80. So it's only $219 for the box. Bing. <laughs> um, I think that's a really amazing price. Um, I mentioned this in my last Stitch Fix box that apparently it's a thing and this shows like how tech savvy I am. Um, but there's Facebook groups and other selling sites where people just resell. You know, they, they get everything from the box and then resell what they are not planning on keeping to like um, kind of recoup, you know, to make sure that they get the 25% buy off discount, but still recoup the money that they, for the items that they would otherwise just be sitting in their closet. So that's something I definitely have to look into because these are amazing pieces. Some of them are just not amazing for me. And um, yeah, lots of fun and lots of good stuff to look at. Um, I'm really excited. Yay spring, you guys. My tulips are starting to come out of the ground. I'm really excited. It's only February. <laughs> My tulips are coming, so at least there's that. In any case, um, thank you for joining me as always. Do be well, and until next time, bye.